Hey, it's all good, man. Like, you know, <sighs> we're back and we're gonna get this shit done, you know? Okay. Oh, God. Okay, we tried to do this shit live. Alright, we tried. I don't know what the fuck happened. I don't know why it happened. And it's pissing me off, alright? So, you know what? We said fuck it. Fuck the live. Fuck the stream. Don't matter! None of you punk bitches are in there anyways! You know? <laughs> so, guess what? We're gonna record it and we're gonna post it. Fuck it. What the fuck were we talking about, Anubis? We were uh, we were just kind of finishing up on the arch enemy subject. Yeah. Uh, you know you, then you got off on Joe Cronin and. Oh yeah, oh, those, that dude. shit, man. Fuck. I'll just go off and talk about it now because that that's gonna get deleted. What we just did was like two minutes and it pissed me off. I just don't like how everyone jumps the fucking gun. There's no reason to jump the gun. Why can't everyone just be cool? You know, that the shit that happened with Joe being a joke thief. He wasn't a fucking joke thief. The goddamn joke was basically an inside joke to fucking begin with. You know what I mean? So it can't yeah. be stolen when it's just like something that was said and everyone laughed. Yeah, it's a joke that's you know, my friend Foul Mouth Ken came up with, but he didn't even fucking care. You know what I mean? And these people started this huge fucking thing over it. I ain't going to say their fucking name because I don't want no one watching that show that hadn't fucking seen it because it's goddamn <laughs> ridiculous what they said. Yeah. And, uh, other than that, it just it's everyone jumps the gun, even in real life. But on this YouTube shit, it's backstab central, and I don't understand it. Yeah, man. I don't know. It's like everyone's. It's it's like a fight to the top. Yeah. yeah. I mean, ever since you know this ad bullshit, you know, has been going on. It's like people have been you know treating each other, you know, really shitty. You know, they're not, and not they're to going cut at you each off, other. bro. But, you know, I gotta get something else out there. And I ain't fucking hating on anybody. I ain't a goddamn mm -hmm. hater. So when I say, I don't want no one seeing that show, I mean, I don't want no one hearing that show. It's super ugly show if you wanna go check out their fucking channel. You know, they ain't bad. They're alright guys. But it's what they did that pissed me off. It was like, why didn't you just tell Joe? Why'd you have to make it, uh, like, why'd you make a show out of shitting on someone that you were, I thought was their friend? Like, I thought we were all like this, like, you know, I shared, we shared likes, whatever the fuck. You know, everyone did. I didn't know anything about it till I'm just sitting there watching it and hearing it. And I was like, what the fuck? You know what I mean? It was crazy. Yeah. It was fucking uh, crazy. I don't know. I haven't seen some fucking drama like that in a while. Rocky was going off. You you, you don't know nothing about that. It's not your fault. But it, <laughs> the people that do listen to this that might know will get what I'm saying. Yeah, fuck yeah, that I subject. Fuck that subject. You know what? I've been playing all Ghost Recon, all right? It's a fun game. It's in the thumbnail. I gotta get that out there. Ghost Recon is a fun fucking game, all right? And you know what? The whole time I played, I used Fatal Grips. I fucking used the shit out of them. <laughs> and I got 10% off because I used Code Billy. God damn it. <laughs> Shameless <laughs> plugs. Yeah, because the one I did earlier is probably going to get deleted. <laughs> Go subscribe to Neil for Anubis. You goddamn right. You better subscribe <laughs> to him or I'll fucking punch you in your ding dang. Go smash that like button. Break it, break <laughs> that god button now! Smash it! Get up! Break it! Get up! Break it! Take a like button! Get it! Break, break, break the like button down! Yeah! Yeah! I'm gonna edit some, like, fucking metal in behind that or something. I don't know. <laughs> oh, shit. We're going on to the next subject, though. Ghost Recon's a great game. Gotta get that out there. It's what I've been playing. It's gonna do some live streams. PS4 sounds like a fucking turbulence jet. So, you know, can't have that. So, probably won't be streaming that anymore, but if you see some gameplay from me, it's going to be that game. Other than that, we're going on to the next subject, and that subject is, you ready? You ready? Yeah. Pip Monk's oh, yeah. Cigarette. Pip Monk's Cigarette is the funniest goddamn joke. I'm just kidding. That's fucking <laughs> shitty-ass dead meme. Um, <sighs> God, what was I? See, this is what happens when your stream fucks up. You're all fired up, and you forget what the <laughs> fuck you're talking about. You know what I mean? Yeah. Ah, ah God damn. Dale Jr.'s retiring, too. This is not a time to fuck with Billy Ricky, goddammit! Not a time! <laughs> okay, sorry, I had to get that out. Man, I don't know, it's... Everything's just going downhill lately. It's <sighs> a bunch of shitty things. Yeah, man, it, it, this, it, this might not even be that long, but the fact is, is it's recorded. So, nothing's gonna happen to this, and we're gonna post it, whether you fucking like it or not. <laughs> Alright, Jesus! I know you're fucking with me. Quit it. Right. I know you're listening. Uh, you, yeah, I'm just fucking around. But 
Fuck, man. I, I got so fired up just now. This is a piece of shit. OBS. I've been using OBS for about mm, three months, and I've never seen that before. And then this time, you know, we get all this set up. We're about to do a serious podcast. And OBS. OBS disconnected. <laughs> Fucking piece of shit. I don't know if it's a computer or OBS, one or the other, but. Fucking hell, if it disconnects again, fuck it. It ain't streaming, it's recording. Uh, God yeah. damn. You know, uh, that X-Pac, uh, he was uh, in DX back in the day. His name's Sean Waltman. He just got caught with weed and meth after being missing. Damn, man. Yeah. What the crazy. hell? Yeah, it's like I was just watching something called Wrestling's Most Botched the other day, and, and he was in it, and I was like, hey, I remember him, you know, and he looks cool. He looked... I forgot about X-Pac, and then today I'm like, what the fuck happened to X-Pac? Like, <laughs> damn. I had to mention that because that shit was a little crazy. Like I did not expect it. I was uh, my brain was fucked up. I was thinking, man, maybe he got cancer or something. Like that's horrible. You know, horrible. Yeah. That's horrible. Horrible. I'm an idiot. That's horrible. But no, he got caught with weed and meth or something, and he was missing. But that's crazy shit. He was in degeneration. Goddamn it. Suck it. Yeah, Suck it. man. It's. Fucking sad, man. Yeah, but I don't want to stay on that too long. Everybody does wrestling nowadays. <laughs> Ice Poseidon gets swatted. Fucking Sears on drama alert. God damn, man. People getting backstabbed left and goddamn right. It's a crazy goddamn year. It's a crazy yeah. goddamn day. Man, everyone thought that 2017 was going to be different. Turns out it isn't. You get you, 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 you want to know what 2017 is? Same as 2016. A box of flaming dildos. A box. <laughs> Box of flaming dildos. You get it? Box. Ah, oh, shit. Did I just steal a joke? Fuck. No, I just said box. Now I'm a joke thief. God. Fuck. <laughs> oh, well, let me fix my microphone. We broke it. Jesus. Oh. Now you're going to get hate. You're a joke thief. Ah, oh, shit. I'm a fucking goddamn joke thief. No. Anyways. <laughs> This podcast is basically just going to be us going off the fucking rails at this point. Probably going to be way more entertaining than it was because I'm pissed. So, you got anything you want to talk about off the side there? Because I got some notes here. Man, uh, I just want to let everyone know that Billy Rick and I are going to be doing another song. And it's going to be heavy as shit. Yeah, dude, you, you don't even understand. Like, we, we just come up with stuff. And when it comes, it comes out our cocks. All right? And we're going to come all over your fucking titties. Oh, yeah. We're... When it gets released, no, I'm just playing. We haven't started on it yet, but when we get to work on it, we'll let you know if anyone gives a flying goddamn fuck. <laughs> but I tell you what, our collaborations ain't shit compared to what Anubis already got over there. And Neil Before Anubis, YouTube.com, Facebook.com, slash Neil Before Anubis. If you don't, <laughs> go fuck yourself. <laughs> oh, shit. Subscribe, like, support, stay positive. Yeah, yeah. we're going to rape your ear pussies. Yeah, I just, I just used Tommy NC 2010's slogan. Fuck off. Damn. I just stole a joke from fucking Tenacious D. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say? I didn't hear you because I was saying something. You're going to rape you and your ear pussies. Oh, you, you know what I was <laughs> laughing at when you said Tenacious D? Mm. Somebody not too long ago was watching my TV with me, and they're like, well, that guy looks like Jack Black. They're talking about Tommy NC 2010. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I was like, he kind of does. What the hell? Like, it, but it ain't a bad thing. Jack Black's fucking cool, man. I always thought he was oh, yeah. a fucking legend. That dude can play too. Oh yeah, man. I would, I would love to see Tenacious D live. I mean, it's rare, man, but I would love to see that shit. Yeah, uh, do they still do anything like that, or is he just kind of like a stand-up comedian or some shit now? Uh, I'm not sure. I mean, I know they. What couldn't have been too too long ago that Tenacious D did a tour. I mean, like, and what they do is they pretty much just, like, reenact the movie. I mean, live. Yeah. I mean, it's cool as fuck. I don't know. I would love to see that. Same thing with fucking Death Clock, man. I would love to see Death Clock live. Yeah, that, uh, see, now, here's the thing with me and that fucking Death Clock, all right? I always liked them, but that cartoon, for some reason, I could never jerk off to it. Oh, man, I don't know. I, I fucking got, you know, I got, you know, like a half chub, you know, from that shit. Like, I was sitting there. Yeah, I love that shit. No Oculus is fucking hilarious. Yeah, I got a half chub, man. That is wrong. <laughs> no, I'm playing. I, I like the show. I just never got into it because I'm more of like the fucking 
I don't know. I'm not more. I'm not into the whole like grungy. Not grunge. What the fuck am I talking about? It's a horrible word because that's an actual genre. Um, like the whole like dark and fucking bloody shit. You know what I mean? I like you know Dying Fetus and bands like that, but I was never like a Cannibal Corpse guy. Um, yeah, yeah. I get and what I, you mean. I feel like that show is just super fucking edgy. And then when they did the episode on new metal, it pissed me off because that's one of my favorite. <laughs> Favorite genres, and I'm the opposite of these fucking baggy pants wearing idiots. You know what I mean? Like that episode pissed me off, but other than that, it's a good show. I don't know. I mean, like to me, that I, I think that Metalocalypse, you know, was a brilliant idea. You know, just the fact of you know you're you're you know you're a small band, you know, but you make badass music. You're trying to get famous, and you make a cartoon out of it. Shit, don't I get mean, me wrong. Oh, there were I did not know that. That's fucking cool. Now that I get props for, I was gonna say the music is great. Uh, yeah, but the show, it was just like when I watched it. I don't know. I guess I'm just shitty. I can't be entertained. Hey, I'm the same guy. That's, <laughs> I'm the same guy that's entertained by a dumbass fidget spin, fidget spin, fidget fucking fidget spinner. So you know, maybe that's why, <laughs> maybe that's why I didn't like the show. But I will say this. They brought metal to the mainstream a lot more, mm-hmm. and that was fucking kick-ass. That's why I loved the show back in the day when I was younger, because I was like, this is a metal show, hell yeah! You know what I mean? Yeah. But now when I, I don't know, I get older, and I'm just like, eh, I'd rather watch fucking dumbass Family Guy. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I get you. I mean, I don't know, like, it is, kind of, it, well, I mean, it is super edgy, but I don't know, like, the comedy in it, I, I think is pretty funny. I mean, you know, it's like, it's like these dudes, you know, they're they're literally living, you know, death metal. You know, that's what it is. They're living, you know, death metal. They're living what they talk about. Yeah. And, you know, I think that's funny. Yeah, I love, you see, that's what I'm saying. You know, you gave me that Volvodinia CD, and I was out in the car, I was listening to it, and I was like, God damn, these guys are badass. I don't know what the fuck they're saying, but this is badass. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. It's like, I mean... <laughs> <laughs> oh god damn no uh, i don't know they're, you said they were considered like slam or something like that yeah they're uh yeah that's what the you know i guess death metal community calls it is you know slam yeah. you know i mean but there's so many fucking sub genres these days it's you, you know, know what i like to call it hmm. heavy shit <laughs> That's what I like to call it. I don't like to call it any other dumb shit. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Don't even give me the subgenres thing, man. Like, like I, to me, I'm a whore when it comes to genres and you know getting everything right. But I mean, I don't know. Like, like I don't know. I guess a lot of people think it's dumb, you know, when you get into like technicalities and shit. But I don't know. Yeah, man. So. You know, I mean, I went in the fridge last night, and I stuck my dick in a jar of pickles. Does that make me not a man? Does that make me not a man? Does it? Let me know. Because I won't do it again. Did you oh. come in and eat it afterwards? No. That's, that's, that's <laughs> fucking wrong. There wasn't no pickles in the pickle jar. I just keep the juice. All right? Don't ask me why. It's good for heartburn. Fuck off. All right? Other than that... Hold on, hold on. We we, we we might have fell off the track there, but that's why there's something called fucking editing. It's really badass. Check it out. We're going to talk about someone who's a big, fat piece of dog dick, dog shit, and dog piss all in one. It's Daddy 05. What was that? What I mean, happened? It, it seems like the... This is getting a lot more attention now. I mean, you know, like at first, you know, it was the YouTube community that really, you know, took a, you know, they they took the initiative, uh, you know, in showing that they cared, you know, what was going on. And now it's just really, uh, it's really just blowing up now because I'm seeing that, you know, that these news articles that, you know, they're starting to post about it, you know, I mean, that's, it's getting serious at this point. I mean, you know, it it seemed like at first that, you know, I I feel like they were being legitimate when, you know, they went on and did an interview with Keemstar, you know, I I felt like that what they were saying, you know, I believed them, but it's like the more that comes out that really shows the way that it really is. I don't know. Uh, I'm starting to just really think that they're just a bunch of pieces of shit. Yeah, dude. (laughs) Yeah. Oh 
my God. I, I really, really do. That guy in those motherfucking videos. Those motherfucking. I don't understand how you can think. You know, I've done some edgy, dumb shit. I set my dick on fire. But the fact that you think you're going to take your kids and uh, basically fucking abuse them on camera for your little YouTube ad revenues, you're a fucking idiot. <laughs> dumb son of a bitch with a brain the size of a fucking testicle, you stupid son of a bitch. Fucking <laughs> idiot. I hope you motherfuckers are sitting there fucking just hating your goddamn selves, you fucking worthless, fucking non-word pronouncing fucking idiots. All right, what, what you got to say on the cunts? Well, I mean, like, from what I'm reading right now, you know, on this news article they posted, you know, this headliner, you know, saying, cruel YouTube father and stepmom who filmed themselves telling their nine-year-old son he was going to be adopted and smashing his Xbox, lose custody over their two children. You know, I noticed you you tagged me in a, a meme of this a long time ago before it blew up, and when I when I uh, came to light, I was like, that's the same family that was in that meme mm -hmm. screaming at each other. You remember that? Yep. That's crazy. I, I didn't even know about them until then. Yeah. I mean, it's crazy. I didn't realize that they just lost custody of their children. That's... Yeah, I was about Damn. to mention that because I just remembered that I saw this morning that I think they lost custody of uh, two of them. Now they're Daddy O three. <laughs> 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 yeah, I've seen that somewhere. Uh, I, 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 Son I, of a bitch. So I, just just so I'm not a joke thief, I didn't come up with that on my own. I read it in the article. Okay, just so I'm not a joke thief. Don't want to be a fucking joke thief. God. Damn. But uh, do, what what uh you've been watching any podcasts or anything lately uh YouTube wise or we don't have to just talk about drama you seen anything good you appreciate lately because I've been playing that Ghost Recon it's a pretty good game <laughs> kill me oh, uh... cure me cure me please <laughs> uh I mean I just kind of like watch random stuff I mean and you know when there's a subject that comes across you know I just kind of you know binge watch that subject I guess. I mean, yeah. I don't know, like, I just kind of watch a bunch of random shit, like, you know, like, I was watching, you know, Soda Poppin' or whatever, you know, and, you know, Donation Trolls, and I think that shit's hilarious. Yeah, I love them donate. See, that's how I found Ice Poseidon, was watching Twitch fails, and that's a lot yeah. of, that's a lot of fucking Twitch fails. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, let's see. I don't know, like, I, uh, I haven't really been watching as much YouTube as I, I have been, you know, like, uh, you know, Netflix or Hulu lately. I yeah. just... I just restarted uh, My well, Name is see, Earl. When you, when you pay for something, you kind of want to get your money's worth. You don't got to pay for shit at YouTube. So. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's true. But, uh, no, I started uh, re-watching the show My Name is Earl, man, and that shit is hilarious. Dude, I, I used to watch that religiously. I just can't. The Trailer Park Boys and stuff came and blew that kind of stuff <laughs> out of the water for me, but uh, I still remember loving that show. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it's a classic show, man. Sunny in Philadelphia and Trailer Park Boys, those are the greatest fucking comedy shows ever fucking made right there. Man, I don't know what it is. Like, I think that some of the skits... My dog just always... got ran over. I don't know what that sound was, but it sounded like my dog got ran over. What, well, the, what fuck? the fuck? No, nah, I'm just kidding. She, I guess <laughs> when, when people at the door, one of my dogs makes this weird fucking sound, and I just heard it, and I just thought I had to make a joke out of it. I'm, <laughs> I'm a horrible fucking person. What were you saying? Uh, I don't know, like, I think some of the skits in It's Always Sunny in, uh, in Philadelphia, like, I like some of the skits, but it's, I don't know, to me it's one of those shows that I just can't sit there and binge watch. See, I can, but the difference between that is I can't, because some of them are, like you said, I don't know, uh, I love the Trader of Heart Boys, I've watched every episode, and sometimes I feel like they're trying to be like a more liberal or whatever you want to say, Trader Park Boys. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I like them. They make me laugh, especially if I smoke a fat hog leg or something. You know what I mean? Like <laughs> You're going to laugh at the show, but there are some episodes where I could see you going, eh, what the fuck? You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. yeah like definitely. The, like the, the day man and the night man. That was some gay shit. I don't know. I'm nothing against gay people, but that episode was real fruity. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, you know, I keep up with, you know, specific TV shows like Family Guy. I mean, you know. I always love Family Guy. Classic yeah. shit. Yeah, I fucking love that show. And everyone's like, I, I have a friend that every time that we fucking see that shit, he's like, you know, Family Guy makes you, like, they say you have to have low IQ to watch that. And I'm like, I don't care. It's funny. I guess I have a low IQ. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Fuck it. It makes me goddamn laugh. Man, uh, one of the shows that I binge-watched, man, uh, was Malcolm in the Middle. Holy fuck, I... 
That show is hilarious. You're not about to be now. You're not about to be now, and you're not so big. <laughs> Whatever the fuck he says. Um, <laughs> dude. Oh, man, you done brought that one out of me, boy. You brought it out yeah, of me. Yeah, I mean, that's some nostalgic shit for me, man. I grew up watching that show. Yeah, man. Well, you know what, Anubis? I just realized that we just hit 20 minutes here on this recording, and we've had about 25 minutes over there at the fucking first live stream that fucked up, and that's a good 45-minute podcast. I have a feeling that we're almost out of shit to talk about. You want to keep going, or you want to end it here? I think I think it's a good spot to end it for this one. Yeah, man, because uh, this is this is gonna be way better. I'm, I might even take the first part now. Not the first part, but I'm I don't know. I, I'm gonna leave it up. It's gonna be part one. This is gonna be part two. I hope anybody that you know watches this enjoyed it. I'm not a fucking hater. Don't think I'm some kind of fucking hater. There's damn there. Whoops, whoops. Did I just <laughs> did I just say damn there? Damn there. <laughs> what the hell? I damn sure. <laughs> I damn sure ain't no damn joke thief, but I will say damn sure. All right? <laughs> Have a good day, everybody. Me and Nubis are out this bitch. I'm going to play the music. Fucking get get the fuck out of here. Get get out. Go. Get, go die in a fucking hole. No, I'm playing. Don't do oh, that. Well, yes. Don't do that. Peace out, you fucks. Shit.